Okay, so hello everyone. Here's our second uh, lecture on organic nomenclature, which we will be dealing with the functional groups that contain our heteroatoms, which are halides, nitro, ethers, sulfides, alcohols, and thiols. Okay, so this is a preview of the complete seniority or priority table and um, all of the um, almost all of the functional groups in this priority table will be discussed in these uh, in this video series and so now we pres we will be discussing the um, groups that are in the lower half of the seniority or priority table uh, primarily the um, the nitro halide ether and sulfide functional groups which are below the alkane uh, priority and the alcohol thiol and amine groups which are above the alkane alkene and alkyne priority in the functional groups okay so we first start with the ones below the alkane priority group so in this case we have to um, always treat them as um, substituents, okay? So in this case, we have um, our descriptors for a halide, nitro compound, um, ether group, and sulfide group. All of these have a lower priority than the alkene, and so they get a larger number than the alkene. Okay. So we first start with alkyl halides. Okay. So alkyl halides are um, carbons connected to a halogen. Okay. So these halogens uh, primarily are fluorine, chlorine, bromine, and iodine. These are the commonly observed halogens in uh, organic chemistry. And so here are some examples. We have trichloromethane, which has three chlorine atoms bromoethane with a bromine atom and uh, bromomethylbenzene which has uh, bromine as well okay so how do we name alkyl halides okay take note before we start naming that we have unique prefixes for these alkyl halides we have fluoro chloro bromo and iodo okay each corresponding to the halogen elements so we first determine the priority functional group. In this case, the halides cannot be a functional group. And so um, in this compound, the alkane is our priority functional group. So we have our cyclopentane ring, which forms the basis of our um, parent chain. Okay, so the parent name is cyclopentane. We identify the substituents. We have fluoro denoted by F, fluorine, chloro, denoted by Cl, chlorine, okay, and then we start locant numbering, okay, so why did I number it this way? Well, um, in this case, we can start anywhere because it's uh, a cyclic compound. We have to start at least um, with uh, closest to a substituent, so you can start either with fluoro or chloro, but we choose chloro because it has it is lower in alphabetization. Okay, so C comes for F, and so chloro gets number one in the substituent uh, locant numbering. Okay, and then we assemble the name: one chloro, two fluoro, cyclopentane. Okay, so it's quite simple. Okay, so alkyl halides can also be named with um, common names. And this is typically formed using the term alkyl plus halide. So we use the alkyl name and then end it with the halide name. Okay, so these are usually only used for simple um, alkyl halides. So for example, we have one chlorobutane. You can name it as butyl chloride. So this is the butyl group connected to our chloride. 
isobutyl chloride, remember isobutyl is uh, an acceptable um, complex substituent name. So in this case, we used it isobutyl chloride. But if we were to name it systematically, we'd use 1 chloro, okay, 1 chloro, 2 methyl propane, ito yung propane. Okay, so there you go. Okay, if we have um, three um, halides of um, of the three of the same halide connected to a methyl group, okay, we call it a haloform. Okay, we have chloroform there. So that's the structure of chloroform, the um, the popular solvent. Uh, likewise, uh, there exists other form. Okay, of uh, three alkyl halide connected to a methyl group. There's also fluoroform, bromoform, and iodoform as well. So, <clears throat> this is the general structure of the haloform name. Likewise, uh, there's also common names for um, methyl groups connected to two chlorine or uh, halide atoms. We call them methylene halides or methylene dihalides. Okay? So, for example, methylene chloride, this is its structure. We have two um, chlorine atoms connected to methyl. Uh, the common and systematic name for it is dichloromethane or DCM, which is uh, an abbreviation. And then for four halogens connected to a methyl group, <coughs> we term it as carbon tetrahalide, which, actually, um, which is actually a inorganic name okay because um, some people claim that it's not anymore an organic compound because it lacks hydrogens okay okay next come the nitro compounds and we can use the same line of reasoning uh, or line of um, system for naming alkyl halides when naming nitro compounds and so um, in nitro compounds uh, Carbons are bound to the nitrogen atom of the nitro group. Okay, so this is the nitro group shown. Okay, and as you can see, they have a formal charge uh, of N uh, in a positive form and oxygen in a negative form. It actually resonates um, between each form. Okay, and so um, nitro groups are actually very um, reactive materials. Okay, and um, a popular nitro compound is 246-trinitrotoluene, which is uh, also known as TNT. Okay, um, here's nitromethane and 246-trinitrophenol, which are also um, explosives. Okay, so what happens when, <coughs> when nitro compounds are burned? They form uh, nitrous oxide or nitrogen gas, um, and so that um, gas release is what causes the um, uh, abrupt explosion. Okay, so these are nitro compounds. So how do we name nitro compounds? In the same way as um, halogen compounds, we use the nitro group. Okay, uh, at this point, um, nitro group. Um, Halogen, uh, alkyl halides, and uh, sulfides and ethers, they are all in a level playing field, and so they do not have any higher priority between each other. Okay? So the priority functional group in this case is still cyclopentane. Okay? So we identify the substituents. We have a nitro group, okay? NO2, one nitrogen, two oxygen, and we have chloro which is chlorine and then we do the numbering again same situation as before chloro has a lower uh, rank in the alphabetization and so gets the lower number as well okay so when we form the name one chloro two nitro cyclopentane 